Thanks for inviting us in at six o'clock. And tonight we're talking with a woman who has waited almost 24 years for justice for her first husband, a Beech Grove police officer who was killed in the line of duty. Today, our Rich and I talked to Dee Dee Horan about her hopes and her perspective as the state of Indiana now is ready to resume death row executions. Dee Dee Horn got a call from the Indiana Attorney General's office Wednesday. They told her that the Department of Correction is ready to resume executions, and the man who killed her first husband, Beach Grove Police Officer Bill Tony, is second in line for the long-awaited death penalty. I don't feel joy. I don't feel um, happiness. I feel like that the justice just needs to be served, and this is what. This is the justice that should be given to to Bill. Benjamin Ritchie shot and killed Officer Tony in September 2000. He was tried and convicted in a court of law in the state of Indiana, sentenced to death, and yet here we are, you know, um, all of these years later. So um, I do think that it is it's something that needs it needs to happen. I, I think if we if the state of Indiana doesn't go through with these execution that it just devalues the lives of the the people that have been killed and I will especially you know speak for police officers. Two other cases of police officers murdered are currently awaiting death penalty trials. Eight men sit on Indiana's death row, but the state has not executed anyone since 2009. Do you look forward to attending Benjamin Ritchie's execution? Mm, I don't know. I can't answer that yet. I've thought about it. Looking forward to is, is not the, the right word. Will I be there? I think yes. I don't need that to happen to be healed. I need it to happen for for justice and for a message and for Bill. I don't I don't need it. I don't need it for me. So maybe I'll be there. Um, but again, I'll entertain that when when they actually say that it's going to happen on this day, a day that may be finally coming in Indianapolis, Rich Knight, 13 News. The state has first asked for an execution date for Joseph Cochran. He killed four men in Fort Wayne back in 1997.